briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a dispute between the personal representative of John Henry M. Chamberlain's estate and his friend Alfred Thomas, the Nebraska Supreme Court decided in 2002 that a person has the right to change the type of account they hold at a bank, but must give written notice to exercise this right and add a pay-on-death beneficiary. The case centered on the fact that Thomas claimed to have been added as a pay-on-death beneficiary to Chamberlain's single-party certificate of deposit account, but he did not have written notice to support his claim. The court found that under the Nebraska Probate Code, signed written notice was necessary to change the type of account and that Thomas did not have the right to alter the type of account without providing written notice. As a result, summary judgment was entered for Ivory Pearl Newman, the personal representative of Chamberlain's estate. The justices held that the district court correctly granted summary judgment for Newman since no signed written notice was provided to add Thomas as the pay-on-death beneficiary. The decision was affirmed, as Thomas failed to show signed written notice was given, and the court determined that a continuance of the summary judgment hearing lay within the trial court's discretion. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.